All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to another Q&A Sunday and I'm here with my wife. Hi. Yep, and I just had a birthday, in case y'all didn't know. My birthday was on December 11th. So those of y'all that didn't get me presents, just get out, <laughs> just get out. Uh, but also I wanted to say that I started a music channel. A lot of people have been asking me, where do I get my like non-copyrighted stuff? You know, and it is very annoying to have to look for it. You know, it really is. And so I decided to just make my own little music channel where, you know, I'll just be putting a lot of music that I use in my videos and then of course some other music that I like and everything. So then y'all have a place to go to that will have a bunch of different non-copyrighted stuff that you can put on your YouTube channel and everything. So it's really nice. I might be doing a giveaway once I hit a hundred subs and so on. So I don't know. We'll have to see once I hit a hundred subs. What? You didn't tell them the name of it. Well, I, I was about to, Jennifer. Yeah. I was going to just get out the initial information. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, this woman right here. But the name of it we both came up with is Public Jukebox. So, you know, get it like a jukebox, but it's public because it's, you know, free to use, uh -huh. non-copyrighted. Uh, uh, but yeah, so be sure to go check that out. Uh, link will be down in the description uh, if you like music. Check it out. We'll be having a nice variety of music there. If you are an artist that makes music and you want to, you know, show me your stuff, uh, d there's a business email there on the about page. And so then you can just go ahead and email me there and I'll check it out. So uh, I guess that's it. Now let's go cool ahead and get beans. into these questions. All right. So the first question is from Reflex IW, or you could just say Reflex. Um, hey Duquesne, my questions are, what is your favorite non-forge map? Probably the new Bloodline. I really like the way it looks and everything. It's very pretty. I like the different things that it's, of course it would have been one of the like Blood Gulch, Coagulation, Hemorrhage, mm -hmm. something like that. But cause I like the vehicle stuff, but Bloodline provides nice cover for people who aren't in vehicles, especially in the center of the map with that little base or something in the center of the map. And you know, I just like all the little small additions into it. So uh, probably uh, Bloodline now. Uh, what is your favorite Forge map? I don't really have a favorite. It's, it's kind of tough to, kind of tough to choose, you know? Um, my own personal favorite Forge map? Because I can't choose someone else's favorite. Because I really he, don't. Does I don't he think mean I a have map one. That you can forge on, or does he mean a custom map oh. that's been built? Oh, oh, I think a custom map that's been built. Okay. So I think that. Um, I would have to say though, a custom map that has been built, but I can't really choose other people's because I don't really know if I have a favorite of other people's. I would probably just choose one of mine, and one of mine is probably Roadwork Ahead. I really love that map. That was awesome map. So that's probably, uh, I would just personally mind. If you're talking about just a forge map, like forging wise. Um, like, the, like your favorite map yeah, to forge on? Uh, probably, I would have to go with Halo 2 Anniversary because it includes like the terrain stuff. And I would probably do, uh, mm, I like a wash because the water, you know? But then I uh, like other ones, um, whatever it's called, the, whatever the, uh, Ascension one. Oh my gosh, I'm brain farting now. Sky, 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 skyward. There you go. Um, I like skyward because of the ring, but I like, I would say a wash because I like the water. I like having the water there. So uh, I would guess I would say a wash. Um, what, is, what is the feature, if any, you want removed? Uh, from Forge in Halo 5. Uh, removed from Forge in Halo 5? I wouldn't want any features removed. You know? You want features added. Yeah, or features quickened. I love the dynamic lighting, but I want it to be quickened on where you're not, if you have a lot of objects out on the map, it doesn't take as long to generate the lighting. Or add an option to that to where you could turn off dynamic lighting just in Forge. You know, you could turn it off and on, so if you do want to see your map in dynamic lighting, you could see it. Mm -hmm. Or you could turn it off so you won't have to worry about generating lighting at all in Forge. Yeah. That would be a nice little tidbit there. All right, so Emperor Lady Duquesne, what is your favorite video game? Um, Sorry about spellings. I'm British. Was there any misspellings there? It's always so. hard for me to pick favorites, but um, I love Bomberman 2 on Super Nintendo. Mm, she does. But like does. current games, all the Lego games, I don't know if I have a favorite Lego game. I don't think so. I think I love all the Lego games. Yeah. They're all pretty yeah, they're equally all pretty good. awesome. 
Well, I wouldn't say they're all well, equally, equally awesome. Yeah, I mean, there are. Some, I just can't think of which one. I wasn't I as like big of a fan of Lego most. Marvel. Like the flying mechanics was really yeah. wonky in Lego Marvel. What about the Lord of the Rings? Was pretty. Yeah, Lord pretty Lego good. Lord of the Rings is probably my favorite. Now that a new Star Wars movie is coming out, they're kind of come out with a new know, Star Indiana Wars Lego Jones. game. The Indiana and Jones was good too. The problem is the Star Wars games didn't have the open world hub area because mm -hmm. they were the first ones. And so, you know, I would really, I want to see an open world How like Star change. Wars, you know, and that'll yeah. probably be my favorite. But, but I mean, I'm a Nintendo freak, so yeah. anything like, you know, all the Mario, Super Mario World, uh, yeah. you know, Super Mario yep. World 3D, Donkey Kong. Mm -hmm. Country. Mm -hmm. Anyway. All right. So Captain Curlio asked, uh, I haven't asked a question in two weeks, so I apologize for my ab absence. I know I was missed by the masses. Yes. He was very Sorely missed. missed. Uh, the Halo 5 beta is in less than a month. How excited are you? Frank is at you. So it's something to do with him. And it, I, I, don't I don't know. know. <laughs> him and that other. They're probably <laughs> just having a thing between each other. Um, how excited? I'm very excited. Uh, to me, it looks like a lot of fun. Uh, I know a lot of people are, you know, throwing fits about sprint being in there. Um, but I think they balance it pretty well. Like, if you get shot while sprinting, you stop sprinting. So it's not like you could get shot and keep running, at, you know, at the same time uh, and get away from battle. Immediately, once you get shot, you stop. Um, at least that's why I heard from, I think, Green Skull's video. So blame him if that's not true, because I think I heard that from his video. Um... Uh, but then also your shields can't regenerate while you're sprinting so if you're down to like no shields and then you start sprinting someone can still just shoot you and you're dead uh, you know I think they balance it out pretty well and I don't know why all competitive people like throw a fit about sprinting like if it's implemented in the game originally the maps will be built for sprinting so it's not like they break the maps yeah and there are other games that are competitive that have sprinting in them a lot of games have sprinting in them that are you know competitive they have competitions and things like that do you think you're so, going off the question a little no bit i'm just saying this right now How just because i don't get Halo it Halo Five <laughs> the reason why people are so his like all hissy fitted over you know sprinting is because they're stuck in the original ways of halo and they can't uh, get away from the original, you know, which, and then they would complain if they kept it exactly the same, then those people would also complain that they're keeping it the same. And they also sit there and say, well, you could change things a little bit. Well, then I would like to hear their suggestions on changing things a little bit for the, you know, like off of Halo 2 or Halo 3's, you know, mm -hmm. uh, competitive. Um, and with changing it to where it feels fresh and new. A lot of people always complain about things, but don't actually give suggestions on how they can make something better because they can't think of anything how to make something better. I don't just get saying. him started on this stuff. Just that, saying. That question had nothing to do with what you just uh, said. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. How excited are how you? How excited am I? That's how excited okay. I am. I'm very excited for the Halo 5 beta. All right. Um, Temporal Enigma asks, uh, what is love? <laughs> Baby, <laughs> don't hurt me. Baby, don't hurt me. Is, no more. What is love? Why don't you not gonna answer that? <laughs> that's why I said. That's the answer. That that's the question. Baby, don't hurt me. Yeah, right here is love, guys. That right here is love. love. <laughs> you can't explain love. Uh, all right. So why Hello, girls like yeah. me? Uh oh, this guy's the uh -oh. next question didn't show up. Okay. Um, why don't girls like me? We don't know you, so we I don't, don't know. know. Um, I'm sure somebody does. Uh, you just might not know. Yeah, probably. Um, how do I get a girl? Be yourself. Yeah. Like really, don't don't change yourself just to get a girl. That's dumb. That won't because work. yeah, that won't work out in the long run. Um, so pretty much yeah, that. Uh, why aren't I your favorite? Because we're each other's favorites. Yeah. Sorry. I already have a favorite right here. You can't have more um, than one. Why does Wolf smell like bananas? Well, he's an ape. <laughs> <laughs> he's an ape. <laughs> that came from her. <laughs> so, Wolf, you could get mad at Jennifer over this. Um, well, I was going to say, because back whenever he was a child, um, he had some experiments, you know, on him. Like, he went to a scientific lab because they are like, why is everything gonna in the future gonna be blamed from this guy? 
So they started doing so did experiments they test on them. them in the same lab room they, as the monkeys. I, I, maybe, <laughs> but they tested them, and some of the and stuff that they bananas. injected them with, and it made them really strange. And you know, uh, it also made them smell like bananas. But also, the ironic thing is, by them testing this, because they know in the future that things will be blamed because of him. Uh, but by them testing on him that's what caused him ah, to be blamed that's irony so folks. yeah so that's, you know, irony. that's terrible okay all right so where's the beef Ooh. i don't know where the beef is in our freezer and that is true too um why aren't i aiden's uncle nigma uncle nigma <laughs> that's pretty good you could be his uncle nigma yeah sure why not just don't come around him <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, this next one, I think he put it in like maybe white lettering or uh -oh. something. So, or I don't know. Did he not notice that it did that? Uh, or do you it think didn't, maybe? No, it didn't do that on the other deal. Let me go to the full say, version of the site, the not one. the mobile. Um, so We're reading it on a white background and it's not showing yeah, the Yeah, it's letters. not showing up. So let me look at Yeah, there we go. Oh, okay. Okay, so this question is asked by Bedazzled Bacon. Ooh. And he asked, uh, what do y'all think? Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, hold on, hold on. We're, we're getting there. Oh, it's because he changed the color. Mm -hmm. If you notice, this is kind of like a grayish, more grayish white color. This is a complete white. Mm -hmm. That's why he changed it. Uh, why do you think... Uh, what do you think can possibly be the most amazing wedding proposal? Oh, I would have to say that's... my wedding proposal, you know. <laughs> mm, just saying. Uh, uh, no, I that, don't know. That's not easy to answer because it depends on the it girl. It depends on the person. Some some yeah. some girls would want a, a big public yeah, you know, not display. Her. And, some and I actually want did do a somewhat private. public thing, but there yeah. wasn't people it was around. Outside, but there but wasn't still, really anybody around. Yeah. So it kind of depends on the girl. That's not really a question we can answer. Yeah. So yeah, it just depends on whatever girl. If she wants something yeah. more private and intimate and romantic yep. or something more and we got a some, big public we got some display. bass going on in the background. Got some cars outside rocking the bass. I wonder <laughs> if they can hear that. Uh, probably not. It probably not. won't come through on yeah, the Yeah, it probably won't come through. All right, so uh, question number two, out of all the Halo games that had Forge, uh, what Halo did you think had the best set of forged maps um like people like people who forge like custom maps i'm guessing that's what he's asking had Maybe. the best set of custom maps um i'll answer just in case he's asking forge maps like things mm -hmm. like a wash and stuff like that um if it's like forge map things like a wash and skyward and things like that and naturally maps for you to forge on yeah maps for you to forge on naturally halo 2 anniversary because of the forge i think is so features. awesome yeah um but if you're talking about custom maps Probably Reach. So which one has the best creations? Probably Reach. reach. But I, I bet a billion dollars Master, it, Master Chief Collection will gonna, beat that out. It's going to beat it eventually. But yeah. it's, of course, the, you know, it's only been out for a little while. Mm -hmm. You know, not as many people have made maps. Uh, did you ever have any other thoughts for Aiden's name? Uh, not really. No. We selected our children's names a super long time ago. <laughs> Uh, and so back whenever we were in college and not even married and, and just dating. And I don't think we had any other. No. Nope. Now the middle name we had, we kind of went back and forth on a few yeah. times, but, uh, I think it was always going to be Aiden. Yep. Right. Yep. I can't think of yep. any other name we had thought of. Um, number four, uh, when do you think you'll give Aiden the talk or will you let the science teacher let sex ed video teach him? I don't think my parents never gave me the talk and I never learned it from, like a science video or a sex ed or anything like that. It's because of whenever you go to school, you're well, going to you hear, hear from hear people from your or friends or you see it on TV. You just kind of learn about you it. You see it in a movie. If he asks, you know, something, well, yeah, then of course we, we would, would answer it and try to explain. But we, but, wouldn't, but we wouldn't just come out and say, Aiden, we need to have we a talk. We need to have the talk. I don't think we would do that because you know? I don't think it's necessary. No, yeah. So I think you kind of learn as you age. Yep. Yep, pretty much. Now, and yeah, you, again, if you ask questions, in, yeah, we'll answer. And in our world, you're exposed yeah. to it so yeah, much. Yeah, so much. With you like already kind of know. Anything like that, so. And we might, we could clarify some stuff for him, but I, I'm pretty sure he doesn't need us to, he, we probably, even if we did try to pick a time to tell him, he probably will already be like, well, I already know that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So he's, he's learned a, things so he wrote on nowadays. P.S. I'm a guy, by the way. If you thought my pink ODSC signature isn't masculine enough for you to think as me as a guy. Because yeah. uh, sexiest, sexiest pink, pink ODSC you'll ever see. <laughs> you know. No, I figured you were a guy. 
you know, bedazzled bacon. I don't was know. That, was that all his questions? Vegan. I don't know. Uh, I figured most people are guys that, you know, like, mm -hmm. watch my YouTube. Now, I know there are some girls that do, you know, watch my YouTube and stuff, but I figured just most of them are guys, which that's true. Most of them are. Mm -hmm. Um... So that is the last question. It was very short this week, so I don't have to record that much. So that's good. Um, but yeah, guys, be sure to uh, ask a question in the link below if you want to. It goes on to Forge channel and stuff. Uh, ask a question there. Uh, and then also, um, if you want to, uh, if you want to submit a map uh, for my contest, or if you want to even watch the contest video if you haven't watched it yet. Uh, for a you know forge contest uh, there will be also a link in the description for that so you can check that out also if you want to look at the you know new music channel uh, public jukebox there's a link in the description for that um, I look tired huh I look tired I do too look at the bags under my eyes <laughs> you know yeah but um yeah so uh, I guess that is it. Oh, do you want to ask them a question? What's your favorite video there? game? Um, is that a good one? What's your favorite video game? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would be a good one. Let's go ahead and do that. Mm -hmm. So what is your console. favorite video game? Naturally, Halo is PC. probably my favorite. I would have to anything. say, even with all the brokenness of, you know, Master Chief Collection, that's probably my favorite just because it's a collection of four games. You have four campaigns in mm -hmm. there. It's really fun. The Forge is unbelievable. Matchmaking is broken. But, you know, it'll eventually be fixed. And it sucks that it's not yet, but it will eventually yeah. be fixed. But, um, so I would have to say Master Chief Collection is mine. It doesn't mine. have to be Xbox. Yeah. We don't discriminate against yep. consoles. Well, yeah. We like them uh, I love, on PlayStation, I love um, Ratchet, Ratchet and, Clank. and Clank. That's probably my favorite. I don't mm -hmm. know which one, but I love Ratchet and Clank. So, that's probably my favorite for PlayStation. Yeah. Um, and then for Nintendo... Hmm. I don't know. I think I would have to say Donkey Kong. Probably. Nobody asked you. Just probably just have to say you know. Donkey Kong because <laughs> Donkey Kong's my favorite. Like I like Mario, but I like Donkey Kong so much better. The um, original Nintendo would have to be that. I'm telling you, I think it's called Gyro. That's Some, weird. One of one You're of weird. one of our people out there needs to needs to look into this. Cause I, cause I won't. No, take I the think time someone did. I think someone did in the last video. They said, yeah, they know what you're it's talking about. It's the little about. doctor that you know yeah. he walks around, and then the other player controls the little pillars yeah. to smush the enemies yeah. and let the doctor through. It's okay, it's, Jennifer. It's okay. It's the original it, Nintendo. It's okay, Jennifer. That no. was why you're in the psych ward. What about Game Boy? What about Game Boy? It's just centipede, regular old, old no. school centipede. No. Whenever I had my Game Boy, I, I had like centipede. a Game Boy SP or Game Boy Advance, all that type of stuff. I don't have any of the new 3DS and everything. But um, I really loved Fire Emblem. I love that. So much fun. That was on It was Game, Game Boy? Boy. Yeah, Advance or then, SP, uh, whichever one you want to say. PC. I always loved Doom and uh, Mortal Kombat. On PC? Yeah. Where in the world is it's Carmen San Diego? San Diego. Yeah. Loved that one, too. Uh, that was good. It, that was a good you're one. You're going, like, super old school. Yeah, there's something um, like that. On PC, some my favorite people, PC Some of these people are going to be like, what probably, is that game? My favorite PC, I would just have to say Minecraft because, you know. Yeah. I, I really love Minecraft. You know, actually, nope. 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 <laughs> um, I would have to say Half-Life. Okay. So, yeah. I have to go old school. Or Half-Life 2. That's what I grew up with. One of those. Just one of them. Um, but okay, guys, we rambled like we normally do. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed, and uh, I guess we'll see y'all next Sunday. Bye. Till then.